Come down to 2023 general election. A group known as Youth and Women Campaign Organization in Mayo Bello, a local government area of Adama State, have unanimously endorsed the senator representing Adama Southern Senatorial District, Senator Bino Zdado Yaro, for a second term bid under the platform of the People's Democratic Party. Similarly, the group also endorses Alaji Atiku Abubakar and Amadu Umaru Fintiri for presidency and governor respectively. The event draws stakeholders of the party in Admiral State who extols the leadership quality of Senator Binos Yaro. <laughs> Why appreciating the group for having confidence in him? Senator Yaro promised to continue to provide quality representation by executing project that will be of value to the senatorial district. People of my have shown that they accept me, that they recognize what I have done, that they know what I'm contributing to the development of my Balwa during my three years that I've been in the Senate. So for that reason, they have endorsed me. And the, 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 what, what makes me even more uh, joyful is the fact that it is not only me that they endorse, they also endorse His Excellency the Wazir Adama Alaji Atiku Abubakar for the presidency. They also endorse His Excellency Right Honorable Amadou Kumar Fintri uh, for the second term as governor. So this shows that uh, they are mobilizing support, not only for my own uh, candidature, but also for His Excellency the governor and also for Alaji Atiku Abubakar challenge that people are facing because of the uh, condition of our health facilities is to uh, package an intervention project that will provide health services to the people for free. And as you all know, uh, my number one pet project is the free medical outreaches that have been conducted. I have done eight in eight local governments. Awards were presented to individuals in recognition of their service to the community, hard work, dedication, and democratic sustainability. Teve Zambe, Kaman Television News.